Now this is how you can back up your iPhone when iCloud storage is full. So there are a few things which you can do right now. First of all, you don't need to just back it up to iCloud as you also have the ability to use a cable, connect your iPhone to a computer and back it up to iTunes using Windows and Finder using Mac. So iCloud backup is just not the only option which you can go with. And as I say, you can back up your phone on a local storage in your computer too. But other than that, your options include upgrading to a larger storage capacity. So in your iCloud settings on the iPhone, you have the ability to upgrade for a fee, usually not a large one. But if you just pay the monthly subscription, you have much more storage available and therefore you will be able to back up your iPhone to iCloud. But if you are kind of close and you cannot really fit everything, right, you, you can also choose what exactly just gets backed up, right? So you don't really need to back up your uh, photos to iCloud or you can turn off a syncing of um, messages if that takes up too much, right? So you can just do that and free up some storage on your uh, iCloud drive and therefore have more storage available for your backups. So these are the things which you can manage. Of course, if you want to, you can keep your photos backed up in alternative services like Google Photos or even Google Drive, Dropbox, whatever it might be, you don't have to just stick with iCloud. So just take a look at your storage, manage it properly, and therefore you can decide what the best option is for you. So let me know below in the comments if you which option you decided to go with, if you upgraded or chose a local backup. But that's it. Thanks a lot, and I'll see you in the next video.